Thomas Hovenden. Yes. Christian, this is one of my favorite pieces in the collection. Me in, too. In this wing. Yes, me okay. too. Okay. So we've got a piece from 19, from 1881. Um, one of the things I love about this piece is when you consider the period uh, right after Reconstruction, mm -hmm. um, you've got this family here. It's, as you said earlier, very intense gauge, but to me it looks like they're, um, you know, kind of, I mean, they're kind of well off. They're not, you know, the artist's sensibilities and how he treated this piece came from a place of passion. You know, mm -hmm. it wasn't something that would make me feel uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. And that's one of the things I really enjoy about this piece uh, in comparison to some of the other imagery that was, you know, popular during that period. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Well, it's true. He, he comes at it from an abolitionist family kind of point of view. And so he's looking at making them into real humans and, mm -hmm. and putting them into a genre scene or a scene of everyday life and making them um, going about their, their daily business. And, and they are, they're affluent enough to be on their own. They're mm -hmm. comfortable with each other. There's little hints that they're um, not super well off with the kind of the tear in her elbow there and the right. fact that his button has popped off of his vest. I see. But also it's just, um, but they're, they have material goods enough for, to display things in their cabinet mm -hmm. and, and just to be comfortable. And you get that kind of comfort and that love as they're looking at each other, I think. Oh man, that's, and that's, that's the beautiful part about this piece. Uh, it's a, I mean, he really captured a moment it's, I mean, it's beautiful. I'm a, please, you know, thank you. I just said enough. But that's, we may need to do that over. <laughs> but, uh, are you still filming? 